Tony Stewart announced the seventh annual Prelude to the Dream last week at Levine Children's Hospital in Charlotte, North Carolina. Once again, this event will be run at Tony's own Eldora Speedway to benefit the Levine Children's Hospital and several other charities. It's grown from a 17 car and driver field up to 25 cars and, and we actually have a waiting list of drivers wanting to come participate, which is a huge honor. But uh, we get a chance to go up and run at Eldora Speedway, which uh, is a famed half mile dirt track that rolled in Bernice Baltus build. And uh, we get a chance to go up there and race super dirt late models and uh, have a lot of fun for an evening. And at the same time, uh, get to raise uh, a lot of money for four great children's hospital charities. And Tony went on to explain how the whole thing began. When we bought the track seven years ago, uh, you know, we'd, I'd learned a lot from my buddy Kenny Schrader, who is, is one of my uh, all-time heroes, and, and he's always had events where he brought drivers in and, and got to race with each other, and uh, we thought it would be a great opportunity to, to let us all come and have a race like this that we can all have fun at, but at the same time add the charity component to it and uh, hopefully raise a lot of money. And uh, it's, it's grown over the years, and HBO's involvement uh, has really helped uh, you know, really grow this event. And, and you know, over the last six years that we've had the, the race, we've raised over $3 million. So it's, uh, it's been a lot of fun for us to, to be able to go have a good time as drivers and forget about racing for points and, and all the obligations we have on the weekend and just go back to, to being race drivers for a night. Again, the prelude to the dream is a really cool way to see your favorite NASCAR guys competing in a completely different arena, and it's always interesting to see who ends up winning that thing. Check out HBO for when you can watch the prelude to the dream.